Aragosta at Goose Cove on Deer Isle was recently named Best Waterfront Restaurant in Maine by Down East Magazine. Tonight, chef and owner Devin Finnegan is in the kitchen at Aragosta showing us how to make one of her signature dishes. And she breaks it down so you can make a version right at home. Today, I am going to show you how to make my signature dish, the lobster cassoncelli, in your home kitchen using similar ingredients, but we're gonna change it up just a little. So with my dish, it has a citrus beurre blanc sauce, and we're gonna start by making that first. So I'm gonna turn my burner on, and we start with white wine, and it's about, I'd say a half a cup. We're gonna let that go on a warm heat, and add minced shallot, a little lemon juice, and let that go. While that's going, we're going to talk about the filling. And we use our Goose Cove lobster, which is caught uh, by my husband, but any main lobster will do. And in the filling of the Cassoncelli is lobster, some mascarpone cheese, a good dollop of that, some lemon zest and lemon juice, fresh garlic, fresh parsley, a little pinch of pepper, and a sprinkle of salt. And the acid, so the lemon, will really enhance that lobster flavor. So don't be bashful on adding that. And we want to give a good mix. Anyone who has a fresh pasta machine at home is more than welcome to make fresh pasta and make a ravioli. Use this for the filling. But if you don't have a pasta machine, or maybe you just don't have the time, you get home from work and you just need to cook dinner, you, I had pre-cooked some ziti to just show you how we can do the signature dish with just a box dried pasta. So the sauce has been reducing and it starts to give a little hint of a darker yellow color and that's exactly what you want. And you will start smelling the shallot and the white wine. This is when we add butter. Butter is our friend in the kitchen of Aragosta. And in most any kitchen, we give a little swirling motion. And I'm at, gonna add just a little touch of cream and this is heavy cream. And again, swirling. I'm telling you my signature dish sauce recipe. So that's exciting. <laughs> uh, so it's starting to thicken. And because I'm doing a little different version for you home cooks, I'm going to not let it come all the way down to the thickness that you would see on the plate here. I'm going to start to add my lobster. So I'm gonna add our mixed up delicious lobster filling. The ziti. That's about, let's say, two cups of cooked pasta in salted water. I'm going to add my parsley. Parsley. And obviously you wanna salt, season to your likability. And I'm just gonna start mixing. So it's gonna start to thicken and it smells so delicious. And you can smell the lemon. And classically, what's on my dish for a garnish is a gremolata, which is equal parts garlic, lemon, and parsley. And that just enhances the flavor of the filling itself. So we're gonna plate this for two on one plate. So we see our deer isle lobster in there for all us Mainers who love to support our local fishermen. And here's our gremolata. And then I'm going to add just a little pinch of pepper. And this is the home version of the cassoncelli. Bon appetit. 
Aragosta at Goose Cove in Deer Isle will open on May 21st. The restaurant will be open to the public then, and we've got more information about Aragosta and the full recipe for the lobster pasta in the 207 section of our website and app. And the saying for the day, Amanda, I think might be, butter is a friend in most every kitchen. <laughs>